Hello everyone, Ban Yuki here again with another video. This time I'm talking about the Samsung Q8 FN 55 inch. I did a video about this the other day and uh, well people wanted to know, hey that's great that it works with FreeSync and emulation and all that, but how does it work with the OSSC? Uh, quite well actually. As you can see here, we're looking at Super Nintendo. It's running in line 5x mode. I'm running uh, a Link to the Past MSU1 ROM. It's a pretty good game, um, one of my favorites, so I usually use this as a nice way and look. Uh, hybrid scan lines, here's your mode 7. So, uh, motion blur is not too bad, but I've thrown a few things at this TV and it seems to be working pretty well. Um, I've had some issues with the 3DO uh, S-Video trick that I use on the Bandridge switch. Uh, basically, you can hook up S video to with a bandwidth switch, and you basically get sync from another console while it's on, and then it starts working through S video the OSSC. For some reason, this TV does get an image, but it's all in red. So if anyone knows how to fix that, just give me a holler, and I'll I'll take a look at it myself. But uh, yeah, OSSC works with Super Nintendo on all its modes, and it works great. So uh, input delay from Arting says it's about 20 milliseconds so it's actually worse than the TCL but everything else you get on top of it is it's pretty much worth it you lose a little just a little bit of lag versus free sync and the fact you could do use uh, interpolation I mean there's so many things you could do with this television gaming wise uh, I would take a little hit of the input delay to get all, get all the gains I mean it's a very bright television that you can see um, it's a good set. I, I'd recommend it. So just proving to everyone that the OSSC is a good match with this TV. I wouldn't have bought this TV if it didn't.